uh, wonderful goings on with the beans at the moment. Um, every year with broad beans, you tend to expect that they're going to get black fly, which is of course a black green fly, if this isn't getting too complicated. And um, what I like to do, take the approach that is of uh, my favourite approach is basically doing nothing and um, relying on uh, other creatures to do the work for me. And I'm quite pleased to say that um, we've got it happening and um, we've got the ladybirds on here, um, both the adults and the larvae. The larvae looks really quite different. It's kind of long and thin and grey with orange spots. And obviously the ladybirds stand out quite well. Also um, happening on here is it's, it's really quite a, a dramatic little scene, actually, because uh, you've got the ants running up and down as well. And they're uh, taking the honeydew from the um, uh, aphids. And they're really fed up about the ladybirds getting involved. So there's this kind of, uh, the ants are, are kind of have a go at the ladybirds and the ladybirds sit there and wait until the ants go away and then they carry on feeding on the aphids. In the end, it, it's all very wonderful and it all gets cleared up. Uh, different species of ladybirds on here actually, um, some really quite big ones. I suspect they're harlequins, which is um, the non-native one. Just pause for the train to go. Um, so um, the idea is that they will actually be cleaned up and I don't need to do anything about it. Um, and if you end up thinking that you've got to do something, it's this, there's, there's too many aphids on there and there are no ladybirds, then yeah, do it. But try and make it as non-interventionist as possible. In other words, uh, don't destroy everything. Uh, try brushing them off or washing them off. Even if you use soapy water, you are effectively killing any larvae of the ladybirds which are there as well. Um, so uh, effectively what I'm saying is leave some aphids because um, then there will always be food for any of the predators that are coming in. Let's hope they keep on going. But I, from here I can see about six um, adult ladybirds, which is pretty good news. So... Let's leave them to it.